hello python programmers so in this video i'm gonna show you first how to create a zip file and embed as many files into it as you can for example let's say that i want to create a zip file with these two files into it and the second task will be to unzip or extract the files into a specific folder so first of all let's see what is the requirement you need to have one external module which is called PA tool now for me it's already installed but you may have to install it so let's start writing the code so let me create a new python file here one dot py the same naming the same naming convection i use for my every project now let me open this with sublime text okay so let's first import our pa tool library pa tool lib and then we'll write our only command which will be used to create a zip file and and insert files into it pa tool dot create archive then your file name now this is the point where you can create different types of archive file like I want to create a zip file so I will write dot zip if you want to create a RAR or RAR file then you can write RAR here or whatever archive file you want but I want a zip file here then write the name of the files that you want to insert into your zip file now for me it is one dot pdf and one dot pptx so let's center one dot pdf now let's save this file go to our folder and open powershell here let's execute this file oh there is one missing bracket it should be pa tool dot lib so if we go back to our folder you can see a test dot zip file this is the same name we have given here is created and if we open this zip file then you can see that our two PDF and PPT files are present here. So our first step is completed. We have created a archive file and inserted the files into it. Now let's extract this zip file into a specific folder. So I will comment it. and let's write the code which will be used to extract the 
zip file pa to lib dot extract archive then obviously the name of your archive file which is test.zip test.zip and then out dir which is the location in which you want to store your files now now i will let the pa tool library to create the folder i will just name it as extract so let's save this go to a powershell window run a file and i guess a folder is created extract and in this folder you can see your two pdf and ppt files so this was the shortest method of how to create a archive file and how to extract the files from a archive file so this is it for this video and if you want to create some awesome projects then the link are all on your screen click on them and i'll meet you there bye bye